Hi everyone, Keeper Grace here. Here is the camera that we watch in Tallulah's nest box. You can see Tallulah right here, and then we've got one baby here, and then there's the baby's second baby's tail. I think they're all napping right now. Um, but we are watching on the Nest camera and not actually in with the babies um, because we don't want to stress Tallulah out. Um, she's being such a good mom with these babies right now. Um, and so we want to let her be the best mom that she is. Um, so we're going to watch her on the camera while I give you guys a little update on how those babies are doing. Um, today is their one month birthday. Uh, they were born February 25th, so they're one month old today, uh, which is really awesome. So their eyes should be opening any day now. Um, Otter Pup's eyes open at about um, 30 days, um, so they should be opening um, pretty soon. Uh, last time I was in there weighing them uh, two days ago, they, uh, I could see little eye slits, so it should be soon. Um, Amy would like to know, do they have names? Uh, they do not have names yet. Um, they will get names at Zudu. Zudu is our big annual fundraiser in September. Um, and the naming rights for both of those babies will be auctioned off as a fundraiser for the zoo. Um, so if you're interested in that, come check that out. It's a really fun time. Cece wants to say she is watching with her stuffy otter. I love it. Shout out any questions that you guys might have. Do you know if they are boys or girls? Yes, Brooke. Um, we have one of each this year. Um, it's kind of hard for me to tell. I think this one is the boy and this one is the girl. Um, the boy is just a little bit larger. Um, when I weighed them two days ago, um, they were both just under two pounds um, each. Yeah, so just almost two pounds. Oh, see there, that male is. <laughs> Did you see the little, the little tail twitch when he finally gets? He's drinking. Um, I got distracted. I was watching the otters and not looking for questions. When will they be out on exhibit? Great question, Michelle. Um, so like I said, their eyes should be opening probably this next week sometime. Um, and then those babies, they don't leave that nest box until they're about 50 days old. Um, after that, we will lock um, Spencer, our adult male, inside um, our holding area. And then we will let Tallulah have access to the exhibit with those babies. Um, and then at about two months old, um, so one, one more month, um, Tallulah will teach these babies how to swim, which is a really fun time, um, to watch them do that. So I'm sure we will do some more keeper chats once she starts teaching them how to swim. Um, so probably at least another month before they're out on exhibit. Let me look. These are good questions, guys. Joanne, good question. Will you offer adoption? Um, I believe you can adopt um, or like sponsor the otters through um, our uh, zoo society. You can check out um, the Miller Park Zoological Society page um, to sponsor several of our animals. I believe otters are one of those options. But like I said earlier, they will be named at uh, Zoodoo in September. Wants to know how long do they sleep? That's a really good question. They are kind of like newborn babies. They're only one month old. Um, so they do sweet sleep quite a bit right now. That's probably, they pretty much sleep and eat right now. The, that's what they're really good at. Casey, how old are they? They're one month old today. Bryson10 wants to know, when will they start eating solid foods? Great question, Bryson. Um, otters typically um, will start to eat solids at about two months old. Um, so they are, you, actually, I think, this, I think this one's nursing right now. Um, so they are still um, just nursing. Mom, Tallulah is doing a great job on nursing them right now. She's getting extra food to keep those babies um, nice and 
strong, growing strong. When will they start to swim? Great question, Sean. Um, so mom will teach them how to swim at about two months old. So one more month, that's when we will um, lock Spencer inside and then we'll give Tallulah access um, to those babies to take out. She will take the babies outside and uh, teach them how to swim in that big outdoor pool. Joy, how long is an otter pregnancy? That is a really interesting question, actually. Um, some people, it depends on who you ask. Um, gestation is, um, hold on, I'm getting my numbers right. Um, so some uh, the otters are delayed in planters. Um, and so we did le uh, let Tallulah out again when those babies were about two weeks old. Um, we're not sure if we saw some breeding, um, but... Um, otters breed in the spring or early early spring, and then um, if she's got a fertilized embryo, uh, that fertilized embryo won't implant until about uh, the end of November, um, and then Tallulah always gives birth uh, the end of February. So some people say otter pregnancies are a whole year, and then others are um, just those three months. Michelle, you're welcome. I, I know a lot of pe otters are a lot of people's favorites. That's why we wanted to give an update on these babies. Hi, Tanya. Unfortunately, yeah, the zoo is still closed. I believe at this point we are still closed through um, May 1. Uh, but don't worry. We're keeper zookeepers are here every day. We're working hard to... Uh, keep these animals fed and cleaned. And so uh, we have split our staff into our zookeepers into two teams um, to help keep us safe as well through this. Um, what do, Sarah, what do the adult otters eat? Um, here at the zoo, we do feed our otters a variety of fish. Um, Tallulah's favorite are the herring and silver sides. Katie, how big will they get? Good question. So, um, well, actually, this is kind of a good, this is, so this is Tallulah. She's an adult female. So that female will get um, to that size. Tallulah um, is about 12 pounds, I believe, if that's not correct. Um, I'm sure Wendy will correct me later, and I will give you the, the right um, weight later in the comments. Um, and then Spencer's just a little bit bigger. So that male pup will get a little bit bigger than those two. Megan wants to know if the baby otters will eat ice cream. <laughs> Unfortunately, no. Uh, we'll save the ice cream for you, Megan. Um, all those babies are eating is mama's milk right now. Tracy, with my kids have seen videos of mama otters floating with babies on their bellies. Will these otters do that? Um, so those are probably videos of sea otters. Um, they rarely go on land. These guys are a little bit different. These are North American river otters. And so um, Tallulah will drag those babies into the water, um, but I haven't really seen her floating in the pool um, with them like the sea otters do. So we are just watching on the um, camera. We have a, a camera above her, ne Tallulah's nest box right now. We're not actually gonna go in the nest box with her because Tulula is being such a great mom um, and we don't want to stress her out by separating her um, from her babies when she doesn't want to be. So that's why we're in here watching on the, the camera. Easton, age six, would like to know how long we've had the mother otter. Ooh, I think she's been here longer than I have. I wanna say she's been here Hold on, she's nine years old. I wanna say she's been here like seven or eight years now. Kim would like to know when the when will the family be on exhibit together? Great question. So these babies' eyes aren't even open yet. Hopefully they will open in the next week or so. And then um, hopefully they will start uh, walking around shortly after that. And uh, mom will, te will give them access to outside. Mom will, uh, will drag them outside and teach them how to swim, uh, which is a really fun time. But that probably won't happen for about another month. Are male otters good dads? Great question, Jean. 
Um, so at this point in their life, the male otters have nothing to do with the babies. In fact, Tulula is really protective of them. Um, he has, Spencer has seen the babies. Tulula had them in the middle stall uh, two days ago. And um, so he has seen them, but he has not interacted with them yet. Um, however, when we did get Spencer two years ago now, a year and a half ago, um, we did have Tallulah's previous um, male um, offspring, um, and he played with them, and he was a really good uh, stepdad to those guys. And those two are down at the Fort Worth Zoo now. Are the babies going to stay at Miller Park Zoo forever or go to other zoos when they get older? Great question, Samantha. So these guys will stay with mom until they're about a, uh, almost a year old. Um, so these guys will get a placement at another AZA accredited zoo and probably move to their new zoo uh, next, about next September, uh, sorry, January. <laughs> Sailor age four wants to know if mom ever gets a break or if she's always with the babies. <laughs> Great question, Sailor. Um, Tallulah is, uh, she, she is with the babies most of the time. Um, I do give her the option to go outside in the mornings. Um, usually she chooses, she doesn't like to leave those babies alone at this age. Um, so she does spend uh, probably 90% of her time with those babies. I see a couple questions about the length of the babies. You know what? I'm not sure actually how long they are. I didn't measure them when I went in to weigh them um, two days ago, but they're probably, I mean, they're a little bit longer than my hand now. Can you see my hand? Uh, probably close to a foot long now, maybe, including their tail. Sarah would like to know typically how old are the otters when they give birth? Uh, good question, Sarah. Otters become sexually mature at about a year and a half, um, or a year and a half to two years. So typically they don't start having babies until they're about two. Kara, age 10, would like to know when the babies stop relying on their mom. So um, most mothers start weaning their babies at about 90 days old. Um, they nurse, I think they nurse for about the first four months. Um, I've seen, I've seen, um, research where otters stay with their mom for about a year, uh, maybe a little bit longer. Tallulah tends to let her babies nurse a little bit longer than what we think she should <laughs> allow them to. Um, Tallulah's a great mom. Lewis, age five, would like to know if they can walk now or when they will be able to walk. Um, so their eyes should open next week at about a 30 days old. Um, they'll start leaving the nest box at about 50 days old, and that's when they'll start really getting those um, good muscles and start walking around the um, holding stalls a little bit more. I'm so glad you enjoy it, Haley. Thanks for, thanks for watching. How many babies has this mom had in her life? Um, is the two the normal number of babies that otters have? Good question, Haley. So otters can have anywhere from about one to six. I think two is the most common uh, to have. And um, let me think, I got a, Tallulah has had, so these are Spencer's first babies, um, but Tallulah has had these two, she took a year off. She had twins. Um, I want to say these are six and number six and seven for her. Do they learn how to swim very well fast or does it usually take some time? Um, I think it's totally dependent on the baby otter. Just like humans, we develop at a slightly different pace. Um, but I know Tallulah, we call Tallulah a bit of a tough love uh, swim teacher. Um, I have seen her just kind of push her babies in um, and then she'll kind of grab them by the nape of the neck and, and drag them back and forth in our pool until they start learning how to move those legs. Um, but it, it must work. Um, I used to work at the Fort Worth Zoo where her previous litter, um, two of her previous boys are, and those keepers um, update me on those boys once in a while, and she said that they are really good swimmers. Do they get a bath? Well, you might see Tallulah giving them a bath. Oh, there she goes. 
Oh, she's just nuzzling them. So mom keeps them clean right now. Do you know of any wild otters in McLean County? Ooh, good question, Sarah. I have heard, I have not seen any. Um, I have heard reports of wild uh, river otters um, at Lake Bloomington. How old is the male otter Joy would like to know? He actually just had a birthday on the 19th, so he just turned 10 years old. And then Tallulah turned nine years old on February uh, 15th. All right, well, I, these are really great questions, guys. I've got just a couple more minutes. I apologize if I don't get to your question. I will try to answer them in the comments um, later on if I didn't already answer them. I encourage you to, if you didn't catch on um, in the beginning of this video, I may have answered your question um, earlier in the video. Um, but if I don't get to them in the video, I will, I will go back and answer them in comments. What kind of noises do the babies make? Great question, Jean. Right now they make these really cute, like little cheap noises, of, of very similar to like um, young dogs, young puppies. Yep, yeah, mom is grooming them right now, actually. She just started grooming them again. I can't wait for you to see them in person too, Tanya. How long do otters live? I've seen that one question a couple times. A couple times. Um, river otters in the wild, they'll live to be about 10 to 12 years old. However, in captivity, they can double that lifespan. They don't have to worry about where their next meal is coming from um, or if they get medicine when they get sick. Um, and so otters in captivity have been uh, known to live well into their late teens, even their early 20s. All right, these were some great questions, guys. There we go, thanks for joining me. Um, I encourage you to check out um, our Keeper Chats. We'll do them as time allows. Um, in the meantime, check out our website, other social media. Um, and like I said before, you can check out that Zoological Society page if you want to sponsor um, our river otters. Thanks for joining, guys. See you next time.